Alright, what's up? What's going on, guys? Captain Monk here. In today's video, we'll be playing as Kha'Zix Top. So let's go ahead and grab our Fairy Charm, 4 Health Boss, and I can't get the 4 for some reason, and 2 Wards, because this will allow us to go straight into our mana mew, which is what we want to do with Kha'Zix, because right now, if you look at his abilities, they don't really use that much mana, but when you max the Void Spike, which is what we're going to be doing here, guys, uh, it will start to cost something like... Um, like 100 mana per Void Spike cast, so it's pretty expensive mana mana cost, so um, getting a mana mew is actually pretty good, and um, let's go ahead and grab our Void Spike first, actually, and we do have to go Leash, so I probably should do that, uh, so let's go stand here and guard, but yeah, we're playing as uh, Kha'Zix top here, guys, we got the Mecha skin, which is, I've got to say is my, probably my favorite skin, for one simple reason, it's the only one! <laughs> if there were other skins, though, I'd probably like this one better, because this one's pretty cool, though, I mean, this is one of the coolest skins in the game, I mean, just look at it, it is sexy. Now, I actually have not played Kha'Zix without the skin, because when it really came out, I got the bundle, so I'm just playing with the skin, ever since it came out. And so I don't really know exactly, but guys, answer this answer this for me in the comment section. With the skin, does his voice kind of change to be a bit more, like, robotic? I don't know whether it does or not. Like, it sounds a bit more robotic, but I don't know. I can't really tell. So if you guys have played with, with and without the skin, please let me know. Does it actually change because of the skin? I don't really know. But I'm asking the teams here today, guys. We got myself playing Kha'Zix top. We got uh, Child Clown Outlet playing as Udyr Jungle. We've got Encube City and playing as Fizz Mid. With, over here, we got Spectator playing as MF um, AD Carry. I almost said something else again. I don't know why, but I played with this guy earlier, and I almost called him something else because the recording didn't go well. I'll say that much. Um, Minecraft friend playing as Nami um, Support, and that's our team here, guys. Um, looks like we're not going for Wolves, which is good because I wasn't ready to go for Wolves at all. And let's look at their team, guys. It looks like they got Nivea mid, Zach Jungle, uh, Varus AD Carry, and I'm just going to start the blue off here. Um, they also got Gangplank top and Thresh support who took heal. Interesting. No one really does that anymore. So let's just go ahead and help this guy out. And he wants me to fall back. Good. Good, good, good. But, um, yeah, it looks like we're going against Gangplank here, guys. So hopefully all goes well. Um, my biggest concern with Gangplank is he's just going to sit there and spam his Q and just destroy me in lane. And he looks like he's building crit chance, but he doesn't have much armor, which is interesting. So hopefully, hopefully, hopefully we will not get a lucky crit on us and we will not... Now we're going to miss SDS. And hopefully we won't get destroyed because of that. Because that's going to suck. But we'll just be passive here until um, 2 or 3. And he's trying to get me with a, a shot. I know it. But I got to get the CS. Alright. Good. 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 Alright. Yeah. Once we get 2 or 3 or something like that. Yeah. He's got a level advantage. So we don't want to fight him. Yeah. Because he's going to be stronger than us. We don't want to do that right now. But we could definitely get the CS. Hopefully. Nope. Alright. Let's just get our Q. And we're going to be maxing the W first because of a few reasons. Number one, um, I used to think that getting the Q first was better because of the pure damage it gives. But the thing is, is it's actually... Get out of here. The reason I like to max the W first now is because not only does it increase the damage it does, but it also... He's just spamming his Q. Um, will also make it so you get more healing off of it. And so that's going to make you win trades a lot more. And I just got to double with that. I didn't even mean to do that. Um, I should play Victor. Yeah, I know he's OP. I play him all the time. He's fun. I haven't, I haven't done a video with him yet because I just haven't requested it. Yeah, let's get this. Oh, wow. That was really glitchy. You guys saw that? It was like humping the minion from behind. All right. Let's just go ahead and get three. All right. Here we go, guys. We are ready to go. Let's get this guy. Let's go, Gangplank. Let's go, fun. <laughs> let's go, fun. Yeah, that makes sense. Good job, me. All right. Let's pop a health bot here, guys. We're getting a little low. Let's actually go and use our spikes here just to get some healing going. We'll fight this guy here in a bit, but we just gotta... He's already popped all of his sustain in lane, which is good. So let's go ahead and just get some farm. And if we get an opportunity, we will walk up to him and hit him with the spikes. And maybe not. Alright, that's fine. We got our um, fairy charms. So we're gonna have plenty of mana coming in. So once we have our spikes up again, we will try to fight him again. Because we can. We're stronger than him right now. Although we're level 3 and he's level 4, we're, I, I feel like we are stronger than him. Let's get another point in the spikes, and let's jump on him. Look at that damage we are doing here, guys. Look at that. That is just Kha'Zix, man. That is just downright Kha'Zix. <laughs> Alright, let's pop another health bot. Here comes Zack. Um, that is a very odd gank. I don't know why he's ganking from there. Maybe he's just holding lane or something. Yeah, that's exactly what he's doing. So let's go ahead and just... Um, I want a ward, but I know where exactly where he is. I don't really feel like it's necessary, but... I don't know, man. I don't know. Let's just walk on this to destroy it for him. There you go, bud. Here, take this. Yeah, hold that for me. <laughs> Half top. Good. Oopsies. Put a slash in there. Alrighty. Yeah, I've been playing a few Kha'Zix matches, trying to get a good recording for you guys. But it's been a rough, it's been a rough route. And this guy's gonna let me kill him. Okay. You know, that's always cool if you want me to let me kill you. No, we're not gonna get him. We don't have enough mana. You know, that's fine though. But um, I've been playing a lot of Kha'Zix lately. Um, in a few game modes, not only normal, trying to record for you guys, but also in um, ranked. Because he is just such a hyper carry. Like, he's crazy in ranked. Like, you just carry your team so strong with your, with the, um, with, um, the leap. 
because of the resets when you evolve it, and it's just so strong. So um, I highly definitely recommend, if you guys are low elo, and you're just having difficulties getting out of low elo, try out Kha'Zix, because he's just so strong in low elo because of how much you carry your team. Um, play a top or mid, that's what I would recommend at least, because that's just what I found best. And you should be good to go, because it's just, it's really... Kha'Zix is a really strong champion, he's not exactly easy, but he's definitely not hard. He's not like Orianna or... In um, my opinion, Twisted Fate. I don't know. I just find Twisted Fate really difficult because of his W and it's really hard to time it. But that's just me anyways. Uh, maybe you guys disagree. And if that's the case, that's that's fine. Everyone's entitled to their opinion. So uh, let's just get back to lane here and try to destroy this Gangplank. Because he's not exactly building... Like, he's building what Gangplank, Crit Chance Gangplank usually does. But he's not really building much, I guess, fighting strength right now. He's just trying to get his Crit Chance together. So he's not going to be very strong. But he's going to get stronger as the game goes on. So let's just jump on him here. Do some damage to him. Upgrade our W here. And there he goes. Alright, he's out of there. That's fine, though. That's perfectly fine. So looks like we got Udyr coming in here, so let's actually get on this guy. He is so fucked. Oh, he flashed! Alright, oh, oh, he's still going in! He's still going in! Yeah, don't dive that. Alright, we're good, we're good. Alright, let's just, let's just back off here, guys. Once we're 6, we're gonna destroy this guy, because once you're 6, and you evolve your spike racks, which is what we're gonna be doing, pretty much what happens is it consumes your passive. Now, we're gonna get, go ahead and actually... Oh, I missed that CS. Wasn't paying attention. Let's actually jump in this guy. That's fine. And can we get the big one? Yes, we got the big one. Good. Alright. But, like, see here, now I'm unseen, so I get my passive. And it's really crazy, because your passive can actually be procced with your W once you get it evolved. Which is going to add on that much damage. You guys can see there, right there. It's going to add on that much damage, and that scales to your level, so it's really strong. Let's gonna get our alt here, and get our W upgraded. There we go. We are good to go, guys. Now, this is when Kha'Zix shines. What you do now is simply sit here and spam your rockets at them. You got your tears, you got tons of, tons of mana. And it's crazy how much you just zone the hell out of people. Like, just watch this, guys. We're just going to walk up here. Here, take a W. Boom. That damage. We walk out of sight. And now we go back and do it again. In fact, we can actually kill him once we hit one more spike rack. Let's hit one more. There. Now let's go in and kill this guy. There we go. He's dead. Good job! There we go, that's how we do it, guys. We had to use our flash, but you know, that's fine. I didn't want to use my ultimate because, to be perfectly honest with you guys, that's kind of useless under tower for the most part, except the fact... Thank you, guys. They're all congratulating me for getting first blood, because it's a pretty good kill. But yeah, I probably actually could have... I probably should have used my ult, to be perfectly honest, but... I don't know, I'd rather have my ultimate than a flash, because I actually find the ultimate more useful than flash, to be perfectly honest with you. So that's just my take on it, I don't know. Maybe I'm being a dummy, I don't know. Either way it works, I probably should have... Just use my ult because by the time he's come back to lane, I'm gonna have it back. But you know, it's whatever. Actually, no, he's not. He's back now. So let's just go ahead and W. And we're not gonna get him because the minion blocked it, but that's okay. You know, we're not gonna get that minion. That's okay though. Just go in the bush, get our W passive back up, and once we get an opportunity, we'll hit him. Boom! Take that. And now let's walk in the bush and do it again. And this is what you do with Kha'Zix, guys. That's why I play him top, is because you can do this. If you play him mid, you're gonna you're gonna have more difficulties doing this strategy of just spamming your rockets like this. Because you just can't do it as nearly as easily. Because you don't have a bush to walk in, for example. And that is why I find Kha'Zix top is really strong. Kha'Zix mid is also really strong because you can just go to other lanes and get kills. Whereas top is more of a solo lane. But, uh, you know, it, it doesn't really make that much of a difference. So where is he going? I don't even know. Alright, let's just sit here and just, just clear this out so we can put the minions on his tower because he's not here. And clear this out. Boom. Alright, get our Q upgraded. We're going to max the Q second here, guys. We're probably going to be evolving our leaps next because the team fight potential the leap brings is so good. Let's put let's ping the missing, actually. And so, yeah. Let's just go ahead and hit this up. And there he is. Alright, what's he doing? In fact, let's actually kill him. See ya, buddy. And there we go. We just killed Gangplank again. <laughs> And that is how you play Kha'Zix, my friends. You just completely zone them out of farm and everything, and there's nothing they can do about it, because you're Kha'Zix and you're OP. And yeah, Kha'Zix is just a really strong champion. I really enjoy playing him so much. I'm trying to get my Q off on this guy, but it's just not happening. So let's actually go get our Unseen Threat, our passive, real quick. And then walk in here, and W him. Boom, that damage. Let's actually go back here, guys. We got 1.8k, which is a ton of gold. So this is a really good start for us, which is really good. I'm really glad that's how this is going so far. And hope we can keep it up. And too bad Nami went down. But that's all right. Oh, Fizz got a kill for that. That's good. So we'll grab, yeah, let's grab our mana immune straight up because you know we may as well grab this, grab a ward, and we should be good to go. Let's we'll leap out of base because we're bosses like that, and head back to lane. Alrighty. So um, well, some things I want to mention here while we're heading back to lane here, guys, is um, um, for one, when you're playing Kha'Zix, always make sure to jump to lane every time you get the chance because you're gonna be using your um, GP no ult. Oh, awesome. Thank you for letting me know. Um, 
But yeah, you want to stack your tiers as fast as you can. So when you get the chance, just jump. Just jump. I mean, you're not going to be needing it all that much while you're like, exactly, it's basically what I was. So it's not a bad thing to do. It's going to stack your tier. And every little bit counts. Like the same thing with Wukong. That this is something I've been trying to do more. Is just spam clone or walk back to lane with your tier. Or your mana immune. It could just, you may as well. Like there's no reason not to. Like it's not like you're really going to need it while you're walking back to lane, you know. And that's just my opinion anyways. I don't know. Maybe you guys think you need to go back to lane or just don't want to waste the mana. And with a tier, you honestly, I don't feel like I'm really wasting that much in the first place. So I don't see why not. But that's just my opinion anyways. So let's actually just jump on. Oopsies. <laughs> Hit the wall. Good job, me. That's all right. Let's just go ahead and clear this out. I don't mind shoving him to tower at this point because we're strong enough. We are warded. So, you know, we're fine. I don't mind shoving him to tower. It's going to make it so he has to work for CS, and that's fine by me. So let's walk in the bush here, unseen, and get our passive back up. Hit him with a W. Oh, we didn't hit him. Minion blocked it. That's lame. Right, let's just get this minion anyways. And let's walk back out. And go back in. And W. Yeah, take that damage. You guys see how much damage you do now? It's crazy. This is why you do this. Exactly what I'm doing here. It works so well. I used to play the Kha'Zix where, like, you just sit there and jump on them, W for the bit of healing, bit of damage, and then nuke them with the Q. But this works so much better, because there's nothing they can do. I mean, he's a he's not a melee, he's a melee top. Like, there's nothing he can really do to me. In fact, I could probably 2v1 them, to be honest with you. Yeah, hi. <laughs> hi, Zach. <laughs> Great job, Zach. Great gank. Once Zach leaves, I'm actually going to try to kill this guy again, because I probably could, to be perfectly honest with you. Let's go, dude. Now, come on. Yeah, I got some damage. That's fine. That's fine. Damage is fine. Get this. Get that. Get this. Come on. Boom. Alright, we're good. Is that rocket gonna hit? Nope. That's fine. Again, get that. Boom. Alright, we are doing good here, guys. I don't know why Udi is here, because we're doing fine up here. But, you know, that's fine. It doesn't look like he really can gank anywhere else. That's fine. Oh, looks like he found someone actually over here. I'm coming. Yeah, we're not, we're not we're not diving this. That's not a good idea. Let's just walk. Try to avoid the ultimate. Failing to do so because I suck. But that's okay. We can actually kill him very easily. You know what? Let's just do it. What is he doing? He's overextended. Like a dumbass. Yeah, he's dead. So he's gonna tank it for us. Let's go actually go in here and kill this guy. Oh wait, I missed my rockets. I probably should have used my rockets before jumping, but that's okay. Oh, it's good stuff. Um, he does have his passive though, so we gotta be get out of here. Let's actually flash out of this, because we don't want to die, and we don't have enough mana for our rockets. Let's just walk out of this, guys. I think we're fine just to walk out. Yeah, she's not going to be able to do anything to us. We're fine here, guys. Yeah, that's not going to do enough. We're fine. <laughs> oh, there she is. Yep, we found her. We found her. Oopsies, I can't type. Alright, let's go ahead and grab, I guess, some long swords. I mean, may as well. Grab some boards, and head back to lane. So we're sitting at 3 and 0 here, guys. Grand game plan was being an idiot going back to farming while we were right there. Like, that was just dumb. He should have been sitting on a tower, cowarding like Zach was, because that's what Zach. I mean, that's the reason why he lived, was because he was playing like he did. And so, yeah, um, interesting that um, game plan pulled that off, but you know, whatever. It's fine. We're sitting at level 10, he's level 8, and we almost got our um, leap. And by the time we have our leap, we want to end laning phase so we can go in and do some team fights and just jump all over the place, because the damage you do. The, the damage you can put out because of your leap is crazy because you're just all over the place. And there's nothing they can do. Like, look at that damage. Like, that was just my void spikes. It's crazy how much damage it does. And he just hit a crit. And look at the little damage that did to me. That is one of my void spikes. Like, it's equal to that. Like, look at that. Look at that damage. That is crazy. Get it back up again. And just rinse and repeat. Let's actually get our wards set up because um, we're pretty strong right now. And we are a bit of a threat. So they're probably going to be trying to get us. So let's just go ahead and grab um, some wards and just toss them there. All right. So we don't know where Gangplank is right now, which is kind of interesting. I don't know why he's not here. Yeah, I'm recording this. I don't know why he's asking, but you know, sure, why not? Let's get our leap here, guys. And that is going to ensure us a lot of kills. Because this leap range is so strong. It's really good. So let's just go here and look for an opportunity to hit him with the spikes. And there we go. We got it. And back off. Yeah, one more void spikes, and then I'll jump in on him and kill him. We don't want to risk anything at this point because we are ahead, and we have no reason to risk anything. But if we can get the kill, we may as well. I mean, there's no reason not to. All right, so we got our spikes come up here in a second here, guys. So let's go ahead and spike them and jump on them. And he's dead. And let's just go ahead and just do that. I guess I didn't really use my ultimate there, but that's fine. I really don't mind that much. Let's go ahead and use our rockets here. And get out of here. So yeah, we should try to end laning phase pretty quick here. 
because that is really gonna help us out in, with the team because their team's doing great so far it seems but i mean with this with the upgraded um leap that is just gonna make our team fight potential so strong that we just really can't deny it so it's just end laning phase now by taking out this tower and he's he still respawning yes he is all right good it's good for us he's still level nine for crying out loud so yeah we're doing really well this game here guys so hope you guys are doing this because i know i sure as hell am and hopefully I kind of explain why I play Kha'Zix top instead of mid. Because, like, I play a mid and ranked because I want to help out the bot lane. But when I'm playing with subs like I am in this match, I just find it better to play top, honestly. I just find it a whole lot better for me. So it's actually, um, he's back to lane now, so let's just let him be. You know, we, he's done enough. <laughs> We've done enough to him. Let's just go and kill Anivia. So we're coming mid here to try and kill Anivia. And we should be able to really easily. Oh yeah, he, she's dead. She's an egg. Yep, she's done. So I'll let those guys have that. I'm not gonna KS that. I don't think I even could if I tried. Okay, let's just clear this out. And yeah, let's actually go bottom actually. Cause looks like they need help. Yep, we got it, dude. We got the pings. We got it. I'm a moy. We got this. We're coming. What the hell is Zach doing? Oh man, if he was gonna dive, that I was gonna go back in and help. But it doesn't look like we need to. And Varus doesn't look like he's leaving, so it means they are not warded, which is really good. So let's just go ahead here and oh, nice, nice job, Varus. Let's actually just go for this guy. Boom, we got him. And what's actually... Could we dive this guy? No, let's not dive him. If someone else dives, I'll go in. But I don't want to dive just yet. Yeah, he's going to tank it. Alright, let's do this. He's tanking it. Let's do it. Let's go. It. Come on, get him. There we go. We got him. Let's just jump out because the reset. And we're good to go. Good job, guys. Clear this out. And get that. And we are good to go, guys. Let's go ahead and clear that. This oh, what are you doing here, Nivia? Yeah, this is this is dangerous. We gotta get out of here. Let's top our spikes behind us. We're not gonna hit her, but that's okay. Uh, let's just go ahead and recall here, guys. Oh, Jesus, get out of here. We're, just, we're gonna walk out of this, honestly. We have nothing to be worried about. Let's just jump. And we are good to go. Alrighty. So let's head back to base here, guys. And uh oh, is she being caught out? They're, they're in a fight. We gotta, we gotta go help. Get out of here. Oh, shoot. This is bad. Okay, we got rid of him, but we're not gonna be able to help. What what are you doing, bud? That is a bit too ballsy, I think. Yeah, we don't we don't have much mana here, and that's that's off target. That's okay though. Yeah, let's just go back to base here, guys. We've done enough. These guys are a bit low, so I don't know why we're fighting this. We got 2k gold to spend, so we are in a really good spot here. So let's just go ahead and grab our uh, brutalizer. Let's also grab. Hmm. Should we grab? We could grab a phage. Nah. Let's get. I don't know, man. There's so many choices. Oh no, I know. Ionian boots and health crystal. This should be fine. And two wards. And two health bots. You know, may as well. And now Gangplay is taking our tower. So this is actually goes go back top and destroy him once again because we can. And I don't know if he's actually going to be able to get the tower. He might be able to. Hopefully he doesn't so we can kill him. But, you know, what happens, happens. Nothing we can really do about it. And he doesn't have any attack speed yet. So it doesn't look like he's actually going to get it before I get there. I'm, I'm saving my jump so I can jump on him as soon as I get there. And yeah, I'm going to get to him in time. Oh, no. Maybe. Will I? Let's see. Let's jump. Where are you at, bud? Where are you at? I know you're here somewhere. I know it. Where are you at? He's running. He has gangplank and he has boots. So I guess this is a probably a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, that was a bad idea. Oh, well. It's fine, guys. It's not like we really lost anything from that. We lost a bit of CS, but it's not a big deal. But yeah, I should have realized that. I means gangplank and he has boots. I mean, most gangplanks don't even build boots right away because of the passive movement speed they get from their E, but, you know... This guy's special. <laughs> 0 4. He's special. He's farming pretty well, though, for being shut down as bad as he is, but you know, it's it's alright. I'm gonna come and kill this bitch. I'm gonna kill this bird. This bird brain. I'm gonna save my jump because I know she's probably gonna flash or something. There's the flash. Let's just jump on her and kill her. Get her W. There we go. We're good. And jump over the wall, and we're good to go. Alright. Is Zach still chasing? No, he's not. Alright, good. Oh, good job, bottom. Good job. Good job, bot. I just hear double kill. I'm like, oh, wow, good job. <laughs> AFK too strong. Actually, we could try to take their blue buff. Let's do that. Because, yeah, blue buff on me would be pretty nice. How stacked is this? It's a good amount of stacks. Hello! Oh, I missed my rockets by a lot. That's bad. Uh oh, he's out of there. Come on, can we dive this guy? I think we can. Yeah, we definitely can. Let's do this. Oh, that is, that is off target. We got him. Let's get out of here. Good job, Fizz. Great dive. 
All right, let's go ahead and clear these out. The rockets, and I'm actually gonna miss this one, so I'm a noob. Yeah, let's just clear it out, guys. If he's gonna toss our ult on us, at least give him the respect that he uses ult. And why are you guys tanking this? This is unnecessary. We have minions. <laughs> let's not do this. Let's just. Oh, we lost our tower. Oh yeah, we lost our tower a while ago. I don't know why I just realized that. Whatever. Um, who gets game mid? Oh, game point did. All right. Let's toss our spikes. Do some damage to him. Walk back out of vision, so we have our passive back up, and. Let's just pop our W here again. May as well. Yeah, nice damage there, Gangplank. More crit chances, scrub. <laughs> okay, we're gonna, just gonna jump out of this, guys. We're fine. Nothing to worry about. I didn't think they'd be able to get me, because <laughs> they're terrified of me, man. I'm 7 0. I'm doing really well this match. I've got the most CS in the. Nope. Second most CS in the match. I haven't been farming all that well. I've been more just aiming to get a lot of kills, which is pretty much what you want to do with Kha'Zix, to be perfectly honest with you guys. So, yeah, it's not a big deal. So let's go ahead and grab a longsword now, because I'm going to go towards a bloodthirster now, I think. I have Phage as one of my core items, but to be perfectly honest with you guys, when I made this item set, I didn't really, like, realize that the Phage isn't really that great on Kha'Zix anymore, because the Trinity Force isn't as good as it used to be, so, yeah. I don't know, I don't really go Trinity Force on him anymore. I used to, back when I made this item set, but not anymore. So let's go to the bottom here and help out this guy. Um, why is he backing off? I'm not exactly sure. Oh well. We're coming, don't worry guys, we can fight this, we're coming. Oh, that is that is off target. <laughs> Where is everyone at? Oh, there he is. Let's get this guy. Boom! See ya, bud. Let's just jump out of the way of this. This is just too much. Oh my god, this is just a giant mess. There we go, we got, we're out of here. Oopsies, failed the jump. <laughs> you guys see how strong the jump is in teamfights because of all the resets? It is so strong. Like, that is why I recommend you guys get the the E seconds when you're upgrading it. It's because it's so strong. But you need the W for laning phase. The laning phase W is just so good. You just can't go without it. Right, let's just go ahead and grab this. And boom. All right, let's go back to base here, guys. We are kind of low. We don't have life steal yet, so we'll get our Vampire Acceptor. And possibly get some other good stuff. So let's just go ahead and rearrange our build real quick here, guys. And grab the Vamp Scepter. Alright, so now I'm thinking we're going to go for the BF Sword next. So we'll have to get a lot of kills to be able to do that. But, you know, nothing we can't handle here, guys. Nothing we can't handle. So let's just head back to lane here, guys. Um, so I'm thinking for the future here, guys. Um, I think I might have mentioned this um, in this video. I, ha I can't recall, to be perfectly honest. Because I've done this commentary a few times. Because some games when I'm recording them, they just don't go well. And I end up having to redo them. Which, I mean, it happens. It's not the end of the world. So I never really remember if I said this before. Whether it's this recording or different recording. But... Um, basically, what I want to talk to you guys a bit about, whether I've talked to you guys a bit about it or not, is um, in the future, I'm going to do item set videos. I'm going to be starting off with the Wukong build because you guys have been requesting that so, so much. But the thing is, I'm not going to do them until the item sets are back up because I want to do it out with all out-of-game out footage, showing you guys the rune page I use, showing you guys the masteries I use, showing you guys like the items I build and stuff like that. And so I'm going to do all, all, all of out-of-game footage, like, not like, this is in-game footage what you guys are seeing right now. Like, you guys are going to see, like, my tabs and stuff, you know, on my profile, you know what I mean? So, yeah. This is a bad idea. I should get out of here. Alright, so I dodged his ultimate because I use my ult, which is fine. My ult's on a way sh shorter cooldown than his, so I'm okay with that. So, yeah, this is fine. I don't know why I did that. That wasn't exactly smart, but, you know, whatever. Oh, ni nice jump, bud. Here, take, take some spikes. Yeah, I'm, 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 I should be out of here, no problem. I'm a little slowed, but that's okay. Nothing we can't handle. Let's actually just jump on her and kill her. Yeah, we, we're, we're just going to do damage to him. We don't need to kill him. Yeah, let's actually get that tower. It's a good idea. Alrighty. So yeah, let's just fall back here, guys. And... Ooh, what's going on here? What is he doing? I don't know if that's a good idea, to be honest. Let's just check to see if they're here. Alright, they're not. If they're there, you can tell because the spikes will explode. All right, we're going to get our spikes here, guys. We got this. There we go here, guys. This is how we do it. That is how Kha'Zix does it, my friends. Jumping over walls like a boss. <laughs> Great job, guys. Great dive. So let's just go ahead and grab these minions. Boom. And Gangbang's going to push top, but honestly, he's not going to out-push us. We're going to get two towers, and that's fine. So let's get these two, and they're getting the blue buff. That's good. I don't really need the blue buff all that much. I mean, it's nice once I have my mirror mana, but until then, I don't really think it's necessary because I have mana immune. So, yeah, once you have mirror mana, though, it is nice because it's going to proc with your Q, and it's super strong. So let's just go ahead and grab this tower. 
And you, you can try and stop me, but you will fail. I hope you know. Oh, shoot. Oh, what? Should we actually died? No way. I didn't think she would kill me. I really badly predicted her damage. I'm going to be honest. She did a lot more damage than I predicted. Oh, well. That's okay. Good job killing Gangplank, by the way, over here. Nice job. Uh, let's just go ahead and grab this. And that's going to help out our damage a lot. So, yeah, that was just two balls to me. I really shouldn't have done that. I should have just backed off and just jumped out of there. But instead, I got ballsy thinking I could just burst her. But that wasn't the case at all. So, yeah, I probably shouldn't have done that. But, you know, it's, it's fine, guys. We're 10-1. We're doing fine here, guys. We've probably got this game in the bag. I mean, it's 27-9. to We've got over a third of our team's kills. So we're doing really well. So, I'm not too worried. So just head back to lane here, guys. And we have these two wards, and I swear, I'm probably never going to remember to place them. But I will try my best to place them because they are worth placing. Because wards, wards are power, honestly. Vision is power. Knowledge is power, guys. It's so, so vital. Please, drill that into your heads. Wards are vision. Vision is power. It's as simple as that. So don't, don't ever look down upon wards. They're really strong items. I, would think, I think that they, in the shop... I think it'd be really cool if they made like, their own category for um, wards instead of having them under consumables. Because let's be honest, you're not consuming the wards. Like, come on now. Let's see, why did you just place this in the middle of the river right here? Man, looks like Fizz maybe actually going for Gangplank. Oh yeah, he's definitely going for him. Look at that burst! Nice job, Fizz. And it looks like Anivius here, so I'm coming, I'm coming, man. I'm coming to save the day. It's Fizz level 17. Hot damn, good job, dude. Here, let's see if we can actually get behind her. If she's under tower, we're not going to do anything? Yeah, we need... Fizz to follow up with us. If he is he diving? Yeah, let's do this. Boom. All right. So what's we gonna, what we're gonna do here, guys? Is we're just gonna sit here with this with this. Oh no, that came off a lot faster than I thought it would. Oh hello. Oh shoot. We just gotta get out of here, guys. We're too low. We are too low to fight this. We just gotta get out. We can go back in. Oh, what? No! 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 How'd that even happen? Zack did so much damage! Elastic Slingshot doesn't do that. What? Surrender? No! Are you serious right now? We were winning this match by so much. We can't win? Lol. Why would you surrender? What's going on down bottom? Yeah, we are not paying attention here, guys. This is not good. Yeah, that was just a bad fight by us. I wasn't playing that well. I should have. I mean, we do we dove Nivia when she had her passive. That was just not. That was just not smart by us. So that's our mistake. But you know, it's it's fine, guys. I think we have this. We just gotta play it smart. We gotta start playing it smart, guys. Good job getting that. Um, Yes, because I'm throwing as much as anyone else is at this point. I just got two deaths for stupid reasons. We're at Dove and Nivea for no reason, so that's my mistake, and I should really not be doing that. So, yeah, we can win this easily. We just got to play it smart, seriously. So my my mirror man is only, almost fully stacked, so I'm actually going to take the blue buff for that, because I know I'm going to need it. So let's go ahead and clear out the wolves. And we should be able to get these pretty quickly. There we go. Upgrade this, get our Q upgraded. I like to upgrade the Q because, honestly, I don't find that all, all that useful upgraded. And the Q's damage when you upgrade it is just so crazy. At least in my opinion. I love it. So, like, look at that damage. It is just crazy. So, we got our mirror mana now. So, let's just go ahead and do this. And look at that damage. It's crazy, man. Alright. So, let's just go ahead and head top. We need to get some towers down. So, let's do that at top. Maybe get some minions because Gangplank is out farming us. And I don't like that one bit. So, let's just go ahead and clear this all out. Boom. One hit that minion. And get this one. Good. We're not going to Baron. Really? I guess we could, but eh, I don't know if it's the best idea. Yeah, I'm just going to place a ward and then jump back in. Alright, there we go. Oh, hello. Oh, why did he not run? You're an idiot. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm an idiot. I need to get out of here. Before I die. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Wow. Wow. And that ult is nowhere near where they are, guys. <laughs> Jesus, oh, man, this is just fail after another. Fail after another. Gee whiz. 
Man, that was just embarrassing. That what happened there? See, when I saw Gangplank, I figured he's gonna book it. I mean, I'm Kazakh. I'm ten and two at this point. I mean, no, I'm not. I'm not, but I was. And so I'm thinking this guy's gonna book it away from me because I mean I'm scary as shit right now. But he stands there and fights me. Yeah, I need to go. I'm gonna when I respawn, I'll go. I'll handle that. But I did not predict that at all. So I jumped past him, and Ben, I don't cue him for whatever reason, which would have killed him. I don't know why. And so then, at that point, I'm trying to jump over the wall, I'm trying to flash over, nothing is working, it's just like, wow, fail after another, that was just so weird. But I guess it's not the end of the world here, guys, let's just go ahead and clear this out. So yeah, I'm sorry guys for all these fails, this is just ridiculous at this point. I don't know why this is happening, but you know, it is what it is, can't complain about it, let's just clear this all out. Gameplay got some kills. Now he's still 0 and 8, so I don't know why he didn't run for me, but you know, whatever. I'm coming, guys. I'm coming. Yeah, they gotta be very careful. We have a ward there, so I'm not gonna steal it, but we just gotta be careful. Yeah, Udyr should stop tanking it immediately. Yeah, what are they doing? Alright, let's just, let's just kill Varus. I don't wanna get grabbed, so I'm just gonna jump out of there. Oh, good job. Yeah, I'm coming, dude. I'm coming. Get our speedboats going. And he's gonna flash, that's fine. Oh, Gangplank's gonna get caught out again. <laughs> is he gonna run or what is he gonna do? Is he gonna try to fight them? Hey. hey guys, that is not a smart fight. What are you guys doing? <laughs> nice. You just gave him a double kill, guys. That was not smart at all. Whatever, I'll clear him out. Alright, and that's that's alright. I think he was trying to save the tower, which is fine. No problem. I don't really care, it's a gangplank, he's not worth gold anyways. I mean, maybe he is now, because he got those two kills, but it's still fine. I don't really care that much. So let's just see if we can go defend mid, because these guys are all over it. Oh, good ult, good ult. Oh jeez, this is this is bad. Alright, yeah, we're getting... Yeah, that was a really good Zhonya's by that Nivea. Props to her, that was really good. Saved her life completely, to be honest with you. See, so yeah, let's just go ahead and clear out these wraiths that are not here. Oh, that was a good plan. And let's try to get 18. We're almost 18, so let's just try to get that. Our mana immunes, or mirror mana, we don't have blue buffs, so it's going to be tough to do sustainable damage with that, unfortunately. Try to get this and that, and we are good to go. Alright. We could try to kill Varus, but I don't know. Clear those out. Alrighty. Are the wraiths back up? Yes, they are. Good. Alrighty, guys. We just need to find a, a good way to win this game. Because, honestly, this is a really easy game for us to win. We're really ahead. But still, we're not winning, which is weird. Like, they've got our base completely destroyed. Because they're just playing a lot better than we are. And as far as, like, winning goes. We're fighting a lot better. But they're winning a lot better. If that makes sense. And he's going to try to just grab me. So, I'm just going to jump out. In fact, I'm actually going to... Wait. Oh, shoot. He's being caught out. That's not good. Let's toss out our spikes. And we hit a Nivea, but that's not really good enough. What are you doing? Let's just kill this guy. Oh, that's a good ult. That's going to hit the rest of the team. And somehow I'm snared. There we go, we got him. Alright, good. Alright, we gotta be careful here, guys. We're very low, so we gotta be very careful about how we do about this. Well, that's a good ult. Let's go ahead and get this guy. Good, we got him. Alright. And we gotta be careful about this, because is right there and will fuck us up if we do anything bad. We don't get the, the reset because it's only her egg. There we go. Good job, guys. That is how you fight. Good job. Alright, so let's go ahead and clear these all out. And we can't have anyone who could tank it, but we have minions, so let's just go ahead and do this real quick. Quickly, guys, quick, 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 quick. Alright, I'll tank that, I don't even mind. Let's take this. Good job, guys. Good job, guys. That was a good fight. Alright, we should be able to clear this out and go back. And no Baron. No Baron. We are too low. We cannot do Baron. Just B. It looks like we got a blue buff in that fight, that's good. So yeah, we should just go back here, guys. We gotta be safe at this point. And Gameplank's going top, I think. He's the only one with... Nope. It could be Varus, but no, it's... It's Gameplank. Alright. 
So just come back to base and grab a Last Whisper straight up because Last Whisper on Kha'Zix is really good. Like the damage it gives you is just ridiculous. It's so good. I'm 80 Nami. Really? Let's see this. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, he's going for a Zeke's Herald, so I guess that makes sense. And, oh, we gotta pay attention to this guy. What is he doing? And hello. I'm actually gonna chase this guy. I don't care. You're, you don't have your shrooms now. Or not your shrooms. You're not Teemo. There we go. We got him. Good job. Yeah, I was thinking um, the... Um, whatever that thing is that he has for um, his W. It's the healing. The the remove scurvy. That's it. That um, removes all um, CC effects. Yeah, he didn't have that up again. Because the cooldown's not that short. Whereas I could just use my alt and reproc the um, unseen, unseen threat. So, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. So let's actually just go ahead and jump in base here, get some health back, and I'm thinking for our last item we're going to go for a Guardian Angel. That's usually what I do, but uh, Warmogs could also be a very viable choice. Let's see, what's a good health item? We don't have, we need a bit more sustainability, I think. Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking Warmogs would be the best choice for us before Fiance, you guys. That'd be a really good choice, I think. We could go for um, a Frozen Mallet as well. Yeah, let's do Frozen Mallet, actually. Frozen Mallet would be really good. Where is that? Here we go. All right, let's, grab, let's save up for the Giant's Belt, because I think the Giant's Belt's going to be a lot more beneficial than a Phage right now. And they're actually fighting without me, which is not a good choice, because I've got 13 of our team's 41 kills, which is quite a few, so... They're definitely going to want to fight with me, I think, instead of without me. So a pretty important part of our team, I think. In fact, you should always have your entire team before you fight at all. Like, if someone gets caught out, and you don't have your entire team there to back them up, you shouldn't, you shouldn't go in and help at them at all. If one person gets caught out, and there's, your team can't help them, your tire team, that is, you should, you should just let them die, honestly. But, you know, it's whatever. So let's just go ahead and just toss our spikes and try to hit some people, and we failed. No, I'm not going in on that. We need a bit more initiation than that. I'm not sure what this Gangplank thinks he's doing, but, you know, whatever. Oh, shoot, get out of here. That does a lot of damage, I'm not going to lie. And we, how are we not hitting our spikes? That is just odd. Just go on the side here. Wait for someone to initiate, then we'll jump on in. There we go. There's the initiation we've been waiting for. Good job. Alright, I'm going to go around here, guys. We got this. Let's jump a little over. I don't like the looks of this. Let's just clear out Thresh. He's done. Alright, he's dead. Alright, let's go here and try to help out with Zack. Oh, I missed my spikes completely. Alright, someone can tank it, or are we gonna... What's the plan here, guys? Because so, Varus is right here. Where is he at? Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. I could probably die if I'm perfectly honest with you if I hit my spikes, but I'm probably not going to because I suck. <laughs> you guys already know that. Alright, let's just clear these out. Just be a nuisance. Run over the wall. And get some healing. Boom. Good. I really want to dive this guy, but I want to get myself killed in the process. Once the gameplay is up, but we're not, we can get this in him. We can definitely get this in him. We just gotta go fast. Alright, we're good. Let's get out of here, guys. Yeah, we just gotta get the hell out of here. ASAP. Pronto. Alright, we are good to go here, guys. This game's going really well here now. I'm sorry I had that little bit of a down patch where I got three deaths in a row. That was terrible. But we are catching up here, guys. We're definitely playing this a lot smarter now, which is really good. So I'm really glad with how this is going now, so... Let's just go ahead and grab our giant spell here, and then work towards our frozen mallet, because that's going to be really nice, because it's going to give us a nice slow on our basic attacks, which I mean, it's not the biggest thing in the world, because most of my damage comes from my abilities, and I already have the slow for my W and my um, unseen threat, but I mean, I think the frozen mallet's going to be a lot more beneficial than a warmox, in my opinion, I don't know, that's just my opinion anyways, and as my last item, I like to get a defensive one, whether it's a guardian angel, whether it's a frozen mallet, whether it's, um, I guess, so. Oh, Warmogs, something like that, is really good, I find. Um, I sometimes get a Trinity Force if I want to go full up damage, but Trinity Force isn't that great on Kha'Zix anymore. I mean, the reason it is good, or was good, and it's still viable, is because you spam your Q quite a bit, because it has such a short cooldown, kind of like Hecarim, and that's why the Sheen is so good on him, because you just spam Q and then get your Sheen up again. But, I don't find, I really need that, I can just really burst them down with just more damage, because I have way more abilities to do damage, but, you know, let's just take this Dragon. Honestly, Varus isn't worth it, and if he is there, we can go kill him anyways. Dragon's really fast to take now, anyways. 
Alright, we got that. And let's go get Varus. Is he going to get away? Yeah, no way he's getting away. He's done. Peace, bro. Alright, let's go mid here, guys. We have to defend mid. And Gangplank is bought back there. So let's go actually recall and get him. Yeah, we need to get this guy. He's going to take that in hib. Yeah, he's got that for no problem. Damn it. There's nothing we can do about that. We need to get this guy fast. Yeah, he's going to get out of there. That's unfortunate. We could definitely try to do something about um, Nivea, though. Who would have thought that Gangplank backdooring would be a good thing? <laughs> like, who thought that would be good? I guess they did. Do we have enough for our Frozen Mallet? Um, we do not. Okay, I'm thinking about the War Monks we have enough for. We don't want the War Monks, though. Yeah, I think he did. Alright, let's just pop our W. Do some damage and back off. I don't know why Mef is in the front. She should be ridden in the back because she's going to get caught and then die and then we're going to lose the fight because we really need our AD carry to be safe. Alright, let's just walk past this wall. And minions are really just screwing up their base up top. So we need to get this in hub right here. We need to get that. That hurt a bit. You know, she is kind of caught out. We could do something with this. No, I'm not going to do anything with that. It's just not worth it. I'm just going to go and heal off the minions real quick. Oh, what is he doing? No, 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 no. We have to go back and get this guy. I'll be able to get him really quick. Yeah, he's not going to be able to get it in time. I'm coming, you dick. Get over here. See ya, bud. Alright, they got our inhibs, and that's really not good, so... What we're going to do here, guys, we're going to hit the Wraiths, get enough gold for our Frozen Mount, and then... Turn off our um, Mana Mune real quick here. And yeah, just get the Wraiths. And yeah, we should actually Baron, that's a good idea. Or we could fight, that works too. Oh, he's Ghost, and he's going balls deep, guys, let's go. Go, go, go. No, we can fight, we can fight, we can do this. We, they have one down. No? Alright, let's just take this then. Uh, that's a lot of pings here, guys. <laughs> I don't know if that's necessary. Yeah, well, will your tank this. I don't know why I'm taking this. There we go. We got that nice and fast. My Q damage on that is just... It's immense. It's huge. Because that... Um, t I think it's 12%. Yeah, 12% of their missing health is just huge. There's so much to Baron. It's like a Blade of the Ruin King, but on Baron. Almost. Not really, but you know, you guys did, yeah, just a lot of damage on it. So let's try and... Oopsies. I didn't ping the right thing. But we need to get the inhale and You are dead. There we go, we got her. Nice. Good job, man. Let's just jump on this guy. And that should... He should be dead. Yeah, there we go. Good job. We should get this in him. We need to get this in him now. Good job, guys. I was really scared jumping in there, but I was like, we gotta do this. We just gotta take this risk and do it. Yeah, we need to end this. Let's just get the towers. Yeah, you're not gonna stop us, bud. You're oh, Jesus, they're actually doing damage. There we go. Alright, and let's get this, and boom. Got him. Good job, guys. Great job. So let's just go ahead and take this inhibitor. Alright, guys, that looks like that's GG. Um, trying to make sure it's all chat. There we go. Alright, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video here today. I'm sorry the end was going a bit quiet, but there was just a lot going on. It was hard to focus and stuff, and talk at the same time, so I apologize about that. If you guys did enjoy the video here today, though, some Kha'Zix footage that you guys have been requesting so, so much, um, definitely make sure to hit the like button. That really helps me out so, so much. And if you guys haven't already, make sure to follow me on my Facebook and my Twitter page. Links are in the description below. And subscribe to the channel so you're updated everything going on. And if you're new to League of Legends or want to make a Smurf account, make sure to follow the link in the description as well for that, guys. Because that will help me out as well. And that is pretty much it here, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.